trigger warning following video is presenting someone feeling sorry for themselves because they got caught red-handed. Did the statement post the video from the hotel, it's even more difficult to digest. It's hard for him to reflect and go back to as he described darkest of times. Zero mention of trauma this even has caused to Cassie in not months, but years of his denial. Who else was there a victim during his darkest times? His darkest could be only ahead. What do you think? It's so difficult to reflect on the darkest times in your life. Sometimes you got to do that. I was fucked. I mean, I hit rock bottom. But I made no excuses. My behavior on that video is inexcusable. I take full responsibility for my actions in that video. I'm disgusted. I was disgusted then when I did it. I'm disgusted now. I went and I sought out professional help. I had to go into therapy. I had to go into rehab. I had to ask God for his mercy and grace. I'm so sorry. But I'm committed to be a better man each and every day. I'm not asking for forgiveness. I'm truly sorry. By the way, where is he hiding? He speaks on responsibility and owning up to one's action, but remains in a hiding since the house raid. This is one of the last footages before he has disappeared and fled the country. We may say gone on the run. In this video shot before his house was raided, you can see a clear nervousness on his face and through his body language. He doesn't seem to be social, neither is anyone specifically approaching him. He is completely detached. I believe at that moment of his life, he knows his next steps before the worst will come. And yet he calls the time with Cassie his rock bottom. I'll get to that in a second. Sean Combs is seen feeling anxious shaking his legs. I mean, I hit rock bottom. I'm disgusted. <laughs> I just want y'all to know, like, I'm a kinder, gentler, you know, more loving me. You know what I'm saying? I got a cold. You know what I'm saying? I got a cold. Like, you live and you learn. Like, you know what I'm saying? I love too hard, so I, I just don't want nobody smashing mine, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> and I don't want to smash theirs, you know, uh, so right. I think it's, it's, it goes all on karma, you know, so. And so the karma came back round, because now that everybody in the world has seen this footage, his career is over. Nobody will be working with him or for him. It's officially shut down. 